Hello friends, welcome. Uh, in this video, I'm going to create the components for the login and register and one component also for the home. I'm going to create the links, add a navigation here and also add routes. So when you navigate to the slash login, display the login component, the slash uh, register, display the register component and so on. Also, I have opened my uh, repository for view authentication please api because i want to copy the cml code from here okay so first let's open the vs code and inside the mine.jsx i'm going to import here the browser router from the react router dom and i'm going to wrap this so let's cut and say browser router and inside paste that up okay close this and now let's go in the app.jsx and here as i said i'm going to add a navigation and create the routes i'm going to remove uh, this welcome and i'm going to add a navigation for that let's go here and in the source components i think yeah we have nav.view i need to import this to cut this one navigation here we need to make changes but okay so let's cut this and let's paste it here now we have here a uh, nav with class and select all classes and change the class name just this one is already class name so i'm going to say it back then i'm going to remove this we don't need this is just for the Laraveller. Okay, then we have a button. And we don't need the button, we don't need. Also, I'm going to remove this and we have UL. And instead of router link, we need the React router link. So I'm going to say link and I think we are going to import from the React router DOM as you can see here, hit enter just close that and this is going to go to the uh, we need don't need to bind here let's say slash for the home and here we have template v but i'm going to remove this also this one remove this template and this one for the logout now let's copy this one this is a link duplicate and say uh, the link to the login and let's say here login and one more for the register so link to register and let's say register here and if i save now and let's navigate in the browser come here as you can see yeah, we have uh, home login and register and this is because we have here the max with 7xl but i'm going to the move or just remove this class from here maybe a, I'm going to add the BG to say slate 100 and yeah now we have something like this home login and register okay right now if I click login yeah we navigate to the slash login but we don't see nothing because we don't have components and so on. 
So let's go inside the source directory and create a new directory here and I'm going to name it components and inside the components create a new file. First I'm going to create the home.jsx and create a react arrow function component with export. Uh, I like this one so you can also create a function component and what you like. So let's save close and uh, inside here also create the login component login.jsx react arrow function export component and one more for the register so register.jsx react arrow function with export component okay let's close this and inside the app.js now i'm going to after the navigation i'm going to add div with the class name to be max with 7xl now mx auto and margin top of 12 or 6 maybe like this and inside i'm going to add the routes so i'm going to say routes and we are going to import this from the React Router DOM, as you can see here. Hit Ender. And yeah, we have imported that. And inside the routes, we are going to add one by one the route we need. So we need the route for the login, uh, for the home, and for the register. So I'm going to say route. And also this one we are going to import from the React Router DOM. Hit Enter. This is going to go to the path of uh, slash for the home and we need to add the element which is going to be the home component but we need to import I think uh, we can import now let's import here the home component so import home now home like this from slash components slash home and then import the login from slash components slash login and the last one is to import the register from components slash register okay now let's create that route so a route with path to be slash for this one and add the element which is going to be the home component and let's close this copy paste change the path to be slash login and when we navigate there we need to add the element login component and the last one is for the register so let's say register here and register component in here. If I save, navigate here, as you can see, we are in the slash login and we have login here. Just uh, bg slate and say min h screen, save, and yeah. Now we get to the register, we are in the register, home, okay. Now in this one also I'm going to copy the form. So let's go to the login and select this section and copy that. Navigate now in the login. Instead of just returning this div with login, we are going to return that section we need to make some changes first 
So select all classes here and we need to add class name. Oh, see. Okay, so class name. Then this is a, a form with submitter. Let's remove. We have input type mo email, uh, v model remove. Remove also this uh, v if. And the error, I'm just going to add error here. And margin bottom of four, not six. I'm going to say four also here. Type password, v model remove. Also remove here. And the error, just say error like this and uh, we have a button to say login then we have a router link but here we need to use the link from the react router DOM so let's say a link and we need to import that from the react router DOM okay and this one and here we say forgot password let's leave it and here just add link like this if i save and let's open the project and if i go now to the login yeah we have a form with the email and the password and also we have error here now if i click to this thing sign up we navigate to the register and let's do the same thing here and instead of going and copy from the view project i'm going to just copy the login and add two more fields here so i'm going to copy this section go to the register and paste it here so let's refresh uh, yeah, we, need, we need to import the link and we don't need the react here just link and yeah we have the form but we need the form for the register so we need the name and also the password confirmation and here say register so we have the form with the first input and i'm going to copy this one and duplicate and to this first one i'm going to say type text placeholder is going to be name okay then the last one the next one is for the password so let's copy this and paste down there type password placeholder password confirmation uh, I think we are okay then instead of login we need to say register and let's save and as you can see here is a form for the register name email password and password confirmation and also the register okay friends that's it about uh, this video we just create the navigation create the routes and components so go to the home login and register i hope you enjoy and see you in the next one when we we are going to try to make the logic for the login all the best friends and don't forget if you like like the video and subscribe to my channel thank you very much